Hi, I'm Pierre from PP Production. Recently, I had a request on how to make a Star Wars-like scrolling title in Adobe Premiere Pro. There are a few tutorials around on the subject, and this will be my version, easy and simple. Let me show you what we want to do. It's a Star Wars-like scrolling title. Looking nice. Okay, let's start. Open a new your project. And in my case, I will open a new sequence. There it is. I have an empty ti timeline. I already made up my Star Wars title. And I think you know how to make a title. Just go into File, New, Title, or choose Title, New Title, Default Row. I will double click on the icon of the titler. And there we have our plain text. I choose for a uh, bell gothic font. You can find it in the presets here. Or if you want another font, just click here and you can choose ever anything you want. Uh, don't forget to center your text and also center the text window. Open the options, go for row, start of screen, end of screen, click OK and there you have your text. Save it and exit. We have to drag our Star Wars clip into the timeline on video track 1. I will scale this a bit up and extend the time to about 40 seconds and as you can see it's just a plain rolling title. The idea is to make the top of the title in the preview window a bit smaller and the bottom a bit wider. So. Go to effects, if you don't find the panel of the effects, go to window and click effects. Also open the effects controls. Don't forget to select your clip. We will open the map video effects, look for the map distort open it and choose the corner pin effect. You can drag the effect on your clip or drag it directly in the controls panel. Let's open the corner pin effect and let me show you. You can move the four corners around to make it look like a triangle. Okay, let me reset that. It will change only the horizontal values. Left click on the first value and let's say let's make it 200. The upper right we will reduce it from 200 to 520 to make the top smaller and the lower left minus 100 and the lower right uh, plus 100 make 820. Okay, let's close this. There is one thing left and uh, we have to tilt the plane. Therefore, 
we choose another effect going into perspective and we choose for the 3D basic 3D effect open it and here we have our tilt and we will change the value of the tilt to minus 45 degrees and that's it after rendering we will have something like that and that's exactly what we wanted okay uh, one more thing before leaving if you want to have a background with stars space stars on it uh, just drag your title into video track 2 and in video track 1 you can place your background so I hope you enjoyed it and thank you for watching